Hi guys and welcome to another video. So in this video I'm going to show you guys how to use uh, the basics of Spacey. So let's click in models. We could, we could see. Actually I'm going to show you guys how to install a module. Okay so I guess you see we have this installation and usage guide over here. So you guys need to, to open up the comment prompt as a demonstrator so you guys could install uh, new packages on your environment. So let's come over here i'm gonna click clear uh clear this uh, screen and i'm gonna show you guys how to install and i'm gonna run the, the command to install the english model so python minus m space c download uh and n so if i type this and i run this i'm gonna see that i already have the english model installed on my computer so uh, you guys can see that the requirement already satisfied, so I already have this model, which is the basic model. It doesn't have word to vectors, but you guys will see that later. So, um, you guys can see, uh, let me show you guys the Portuguese Portuguese model, which I, I sure have installed over here. So, let's run. And... Remember, if you don't have this this modules installed on your computer, you guys should be the downloading uh, bar. So I'm gonna tr see that I have the multilingual uh, version. I'm gonna run this command, and if I don't have, it should sh it should show me that I, I am downloading the model. So I'm gonna open up Idle to show you guys. How to, you guys, you guys can see that I don't have uh, the multilingual uh, version, so it is 32 megabytes, which is not that big, it's not that large. Uh, and sometimes you guys wanna look out for a, a better time to sell this model. Sometimes the server is not really good, so it's very likely that you will have to try once or twice to install a model because if your connection gets lower uh this uh installer process will be actually quit so you guys need to start all over again and that's very annoying uh but you guys need to just install once and if you guys have any problem uh regarding the installation of spacey modules you guys should comment down below. So uh, I have um, the English model and the Portuguese model. So let's come over here. Let me grab uh, Chrome and let's come over here. So this is a simple demo. Today we're just going to start using a simple demo. Okay. So let's uh, import Spacey. Let's import Spacey. And after that, I'm going to create a new object called NLP. Which would be equal spacey dot load and the past uh, model name which is English. Okay, so I need to remove an O over here. Let's click. Uh, let's click uh, load. Actually, enter. Uh, let's create a new document. Doc which would be equal NLP. We need to format as Unicode, so you just need to put a U at the beginning of the the sentence or the document uh, this is a test test dot and if I type doc you guys will see that when you type doc I have the the output is the same uh, the same thing if I type doc doc dot and I see this I'm gonna see that I have a lot of um, methods if I let's see ints so we don't have any entity if I type dot dot and let's see count by char span categories I don't remember what this does but if I try to see the let's see the sent sentence there is only one cent if I type for Sent in um, doc and print uh, sent. 
I'm gonna see just one sentence because I only have one sentence. So if I, I wanna see the post tagging, let me see where this post tagging post tagging's. So we have sentiment. We have the sentiment of this is zero. But for instance, if I try to change the document, okay, let's see copy and came over here paste this is very bad by when is it attack dot dot sent it's actually sentiment I wanna see that zero yeah but let's try to this is very very good let's run again doc dot sentiment yeah, it isn't uh, uh, changing. I will could check that out later, but let's click in usage. Uh, let me see if I have any demos over here. Yay! It doesn't have, doesn't seem to have any demo here. So to have lingu linguistic features. Uh, let's see. I should part of speech. Okay, so yeah, so we have a demo right here. If you guys want to see the the thing, uh, let's run locally. Uh, I don't want to don't want to run this on the, the browser. So I guess you can see the documentation that the usage is very simple. Uh, for talking uh, in doc, which is document. So if I if I'm gonna print each token, so this is the tokenization process. Uh, if I wanna, I need to copy this, and if I wanna access uh, each token, I could do. Let me drag this over here. Not the way. Uh, I wish I had that feature that I used to have. So, okay, so uh, let me just edit this a little bit, guys. I just want to put a larger font so you guys could see more easily. So let's put a 416, shall we? Okay. So uh, if I tie, if I put put here, um, if I want to access the lemma post tag, the the post tag, which is the Part of speech, I just do this. You guys can see the this. Okay, I'm gonna remake this and let's change a little bit. I'm gonna pass talking and this. Uh, let's pass pause, which is part of speech, and let's run. And you guys can see that we have the this is a determine, determine, determine is, is a verb. Very is an adjective, good adjective, and dot is a punctuation. So you guys can see it's very easy, okay? So talking returns the the talking itself, but if I want to access, I could do this, but let me see. Yeah, I cannot type back. So if I I, I could do the, the this in two different ways, I could do this and this, but this would be the same. So I pretty much would like to use this uh, instead of this which uh, is kind of redundant so if you want to uh, access the tag you guys could use this uh, the, the shape uh, it's alpha and it's top the lemma is actually very good a limitation is a very good thing but we're gonna talk this about this later okay so thank you guys for watching this video see you guys next time